Before we start saying goodbyes, I'd like us all to get as tight together as we can. Form a nice tight circle. I want you to be able to feel the person next to you. These are the hands of Rennie, a kindred spirit. A kindred spirit like the one we were to remember and celebrate today. There's a unique bond that exists with this group of actors and patrons and family. One rarely found and so much more special for it. We're more than a band of revelers. We're friends that become family. As we remember Tiffy, I would ask that we hold dear the memory of all those who are forever gone from our presence. Lula and I met Tarragon on Green Ho in 08, <laughs> Tiffy's first year on task. She was like a moon me, peeking around clouds, waiting to share her light. She had such a beautiful inner light. I met Tiffy when my life was falling apart. She slept on the floor of my third floor apartment, right in front of the box fan, because I had no AC. <laughs> and she had a key to come in whenever she wanted. As it had been with me and with so many others, fair changed her. It gave her an outlet to express herself in a way that nothing else in her life ever had. She became the brightest and best version of herself because of this place. Even after Tiffy moved to Columbus, and then Dayton, and then Columbus again, <laughs> we always found time for each other. It was never as much as either of us wanted, but the lines were always there. I have five brothers, and I never really wanted a sister <laughs> until I realized I already had one in her. The last time I saw her alive, really, truly alive, was in May of this year. We had a fundraiser. When I left, I gave her a hug, and I told her I'd see her soon. And I did, just not the way any of us could have predicted. Less than two weeks later, I gathered with her family and friends around her hospital bed, and we sang hell to the company as we let her go. You couldn't snare her, you couldn't capture anything about her, you couldn't label her in any way. One of the most freest people I've ever known, and I wish I could have known her longer. She gave so freely and openly of herself. She always had a mind of her own. She always looked at me and said, I'm doing this for you, Dad. And she got me to the hospital and helped save my life. And the one last thing I'd like to say is I wish I could help save her. Because she, she was such a remarkable individual. And I loved her so much. I think about you every day, ever since you went away. You were my tr first true friend, although I didn't realize it until the end. I am a better person for having known her, and I believe that's the case for most all of you here. Remember the good. Remember the example that she did set for all of you. And try and live up to that. Uh, so I was uh, really tickled when uh, uh, Jean asked me if I would lead this, also because I know the words. <laughs> uh, which really helps. Uh, so, uh, but I have to have Travis stand next to me, uh, otherwise I forget the words. <laughs> <laughs> Find friends and companions Come join me in rhyme Come lift up your voices In chorus with mine Come lift up your voices All grief to refrain For we may or might never All meet here again Drink and be merry, all green.
Be merry, all grief to refrain, for we may. 